Yeah, yeah. So I'm not an ardent follower of keeping up with the Kardashian. I'm not uh, a follower of keeping up with the Kardashian, but I know of you know the relationship between Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. I know of uh, the relationship between them. Yeah, I'm not in the US of I'm in Ghana, but I know what's going on uh, going on around the world. Yeah. So uh, Kim Kardashian. Uh, recently, I saw a post of uh, Kim Kardashian crying over her ex-husband Kanye West. She was crying over Kanye West, yeah, she's crying over Kanye West about the fact that she really misses him, you know, after the marriage, you know, she wants the old Kanye back. She wants the old Ye back. You know, she wants the old Kanye West back. And, you know, at the moment, I feel like Kanye, uh, Kanye West has moved on, yeah, he, he has really moved on. You know, Kanye West, I don't really know Kanye West personally, but I know him to be one of those guys who are... Uh, moved on you know they moved on like whenever they move on they move on for good you know they don't turn back you know they are always concentrated whenever they are in a relationship they are always uh how should i say discipline yeah they are always disciplined when they are in love but whenever you know they are like as soon as they get tired of you they move on without turning back they move on for good and that's what i see uh that's what uh, to me that's what i see yeah that's what i see and uh yeah kim kardashian is actually missing her husband and you know according to me like i don't also think you know one person like kim can easily move to, uh move on you know after six years of marriage with uh kim kardashian uh with kanye west <laughs> i'm sorry yeah so after six years of you know marriage with kanye west i don't think you know one can easily move on like that you know after you know having four children since some chicago and north with kanye west i don't think charlie they can easily move on like that you know being with someone for more than six years and you know you just wake up one day and just you know decide to move on like that charlie i don't think it's not easy you know even though yeah after the uh the whole uh the uh, whole the whole bruhaha you know around their marriages you know the divorce so, uh kind of uh stuff you know can you uh why do i keep mentioning kind of words you know Kim Kardashian actually moved on, you know, she moved on, but I knew for sure that Charlie, nah, there's something, you know, there's something, like, I knew that Charlie, this woman was so miss her husband, and you know, uh, even though uh, Kim Kardashian ne never appreciated the fact that uh, Kim, uh, Kanye West was always, you know, coming online, you know, posting uh, the uh, relationship matters on, you know, online, you know, telling the world what's going on, but I think she really misses him. And, you know, Kanye also don't appreciate the fact that, you know, uh, Kim Kardashian is always, you know, uh, allowing their children come online, you know, TikTok, using TikTok and, you know, trying to let their children grow, you know, grow ahead of their time. You know, that's what Kim Kardashian is uh, actually doing to their child, yeah? She is actually, uh, she actually wants... Uh, Northwest to grow ahead of her time. You know, according to Kanye West, to Charlie, the 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 uh, he, 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 no, his ex-wife should allow you know the children to you know be children. Yeah, she shouldn't you know expose them to you know all these TikTok kind of things. You know, for Charlie, nah. That's what's going on in the world of uh between uh Kanye West and Kim Kardashian. Yeah, Charlie, a whole lot is going on between the the two. A whole lot. And Charlie, yeah, I think for now, Kanye West has actually moved on, yeah, with another lady. And uh, Charlie, I think it's too late for him to come back. I think it's too late for now for uh, your man to come back. And uh, yeah, and you know, Kanye West is actually one of my favorite rappers in the world. Yeah, Kanye West is actually one of my favorite uh, rappers in the world. You know, I actually started rap because of Kanye West and Eminem, yeah. Like, I, yeah, I actually started rap bef uh, because of Kanye West and Eminem, and, you know, I really appreciate them, I really appreciate Charlie, uh, man like Kanye West, you know, uh, and the fact that he's also a fellow Gemini, the fact that he's also a fellow Gemini, yeah, Charlie. <laughs> yeah, you know, what, what you know, in, uh, in astrology, Gemini's are people who really don't, who are not really, really jealous in relationship like that. Like, we easily move on. But Kanye West, you know, it's kind of like, from what I see, Kanye West is one of the most jealous uh, personalities in the world. Yeah. 
you know, he's a different kind of Gemini. Charlie is a different kind of Gemini. And you know, we 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 the Gemini's we the Gemini's hardly uh commit to to you know we we actually have our uh, issues with commitment, yeah. We the Gemini's we actually have issues with the uh, with commitments and all those kind. But even even though me, I don't really really have issues with commitment. It depends on where my planetary is, you know. Yes. You know, it depends on where you can find my Gemini's in my chat. Yeah, so me, for instance, I, I, I do commit a lot. Yeah, I commit. Yeah, I, I don't have issues with commitment. Yeah, so that's what's going on in the world of uh, international news, Charlie. Kim Kardashian is actually missing her ex-husband, Kanye. Kanye. Yo, I even forgot to mention my name. My name is Jimmy Ralph, and you're watching Fun Time TV. Yo, Chala, I just stay home and I'm just having fun. Oh. Look at how I'm even chatting with you guys. I'm just having fun in my room, Charlie. I'm just having fun. Man, I'm just having fun. Like, I'm just speaking with myself. Yeah, and I want you guys to take it easy with me. Like, I, I, you know, a few months back, I never knew I could actually set a camera in front of me like this and be speaking to myself. There's no one around here. I'm just speaking with myself, and I never knew I could. There, uh, there will be a time where I, I can, you know, gather that courage, you know, to be speaking to myself like that. And you know, put your hands together for me, man. Wherever you are, put your hands together for me, cause I never knew I could, you know, set a camera. So, and I'm still learning. I'm still learning. So, Charlie, you for take it easy with me. Yeah, you gotta take it easy with me, man. You gotta take it easy with me. Yeah, so kindly subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and always stay connected. Yeah, this is my this is actually my first time doing uh a foreign news. You know, a news about uh the about America, like a news about Hollywood. Yeah, this is actually my first time doing a news about Hollywood. And uh I want you to subscribe to this channel once again, like, comment, and always stay connected. And I think it's kind of fun, yeah. It's kind of fun, and I think very soon I'll be bringing back to back. You know, I'll be bringing details. Yeah, I think it's kind of fun. I, I think I have to, you know, add that. I, I have to make that a segment on this channel. Yeah, I think I have to make that a segment. And I want you to subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and always stay connected. My name is Jimmy Raff. Yeah. Let's have fun. I'm just having fun. Yeah, this is just a fun. This is not a serious news. This is not a serious news. So. This is not a serious news. Even though Kim Kardashian actually, you know, cried over her ex-husband. I nearly said late husband. 